May 10th, Scranton, PA. Good morning and welcome to my humble abode. I wish this was MTV Cribs, but no, it's homegrown Cribs. Um, Scranton episode. Minor league housing is always interesting. If you were to ask Kel Kosho and David Sosby where they live now, the answer is above a junkyard. It's in like a, um, like a junkyard slash the guy owns like he, he like sells cars and then he also has like an auto body place there too and went inside the guy was super nice and took us upstairs and it was actually a really nice place really big I think it's like four bedrooms but I think it's gonna be a, a good spot for us to stay just looks a little different on the outside though looks can be deceiving this apartment has everything a minor leaguer could need but here we've got the kitchen where I just crushed some eggs and bacon Minor league, rule number one, always have a washer and dryer, because that gets a little crazy. This is David Sosby's room. It's uh, tiny, but um, he's not here right now, but it's like tiny and not uh, clean. I clean mine, don't you worry. Here's my humble establishment with my amazing air mattress. And you can always find, you always need a good chair. Because if you don't have a good chair, especially with me being a morning person, drinking my coffee, it's not fun. One thing as minor leaguers, we're always on the go. If you get called up, called down, traded, everything like that, it's all, you got to be pack and unpack really quick. That's where every single minor leaguer has a big tote. This is brand new. Mine of four years broke um, last, off se or last season, so I was really upset about that. But this is new and better tote for all my, um, for all my needs. Let's see if he's awake. You're about to be woken up. Sorry. This is the homegrown crew's here. The homegrown crew. In typical minor league fashion, recent call-up Caleb Ord is crashing in their spare bedroom. Uh, it's a really cool experience. I never thought I'd live in the middle of a junkyard, but it's actually, the housing is pretty nice. The mother-in-law suite with Caleb Ord, New Scranton Railbird. He just woke up ready for tonight's game. And here we have our humble uh, living room, AKA Fortnite Palace for David Sosby. Uh, you see his little gaming setup right there. And obviously, closet space here is not very good. So, Sosby's got his stuff here. Then he's got his gaming system where I have woken up at 1 a.m. hearing him yell because they got a victory. You've got a wonderful view of the uh, valley and uh, junkyard that is here. Most unique place, I mean, we're in the middle of a junkyard, an auto shop, right above a garage. Like, it's, you know, I can hear it in the morning around like 9 a.m., some car parts getting taken off and stuff like that. But no, it's nice. The owner's really nice. Um, and I mean, it's a nice, uh, nice place to uh, call home for a few months.